So, welcome everybody. Today I would like to show the first steps in playing a fairy hair. So this is a fairy hair from Nanka. This is um, jackfruit. jackfruit wood. And I have this tiny bow from bamboo and horsehair. So first I would like to show you how to hold um, the instrument. So it's different from classical instruments. You just carry it in your hand, so balanced, very relaxed, you just carry the weight of the instrument. Okay. And on the other hand, you have the bow, so you take the bottom end, the banding, and hold it with three or four fingers, like this. So, and when you approach the instrument with the bow, you should make sure that it's coming in a right angle. So you see the string here and the bow is approaching in a right angle. And if you see, as you see, I'm alterna alternating the pulling with the pushing. So that enables you always starting from the point where you end it, go on at that point. Otherwise you should have you would have a circle like the whole movement. You can do like this, but it's like you always have to pause in between. Or you have to be very quick. So always alternating, pushing the pulling. And I'm suggesting in the beginning making long notes, so really using the, the full length of the bow from the beginning to the end. And just before it ends, you're running out of like the horse hair. You're taking off. You're taking off the string so that the that the string can vibrate, so you don't stop the vibration. And very important is also the, this moment of, of landing on the string. It's like nearly a zero, you move a little bit, but not too fast, very slow. And then you're accelerating. You're also Enhancing your your pressure a little bit. So this is the one of the main things in bowing is to to um, open your senses, that they, that you feel the, the appropriate, the how to say, the, um, that the the pressure you put on the string, and the tempo with which you go along, that they have a have a good proportion and give you a solid tone. So if you're too quick, you have the sharp tone, and if you're so, too, too slow, you get something like this. Yeah, so it's really in between. This is the first exercise, more or less, for you. So another detail, also quite important, is the point where you touch the string. It's a little bit, it's, it's um, off from the pin where the, where the string is fixed, so as off as you can be. So go to the next pin. So this is the place. So not here. It's a little bit too sharp. It's getting very sharp here in the end. You hear this? 
but it's a little bit off. It's like maybe two or three centi off from the pin. Always like this. And the last string, similar, so the, the same distance to the pin, more or less. So what else? I think this could be the first step. The approach is people already always asking me, so what kind of songs could I play? Um, is there any notations? And I say just follow your intuition, just play, just improvise. Thank you for your attention.